I have already converted my car from since the first subsidy removal. Yeah. You find out that it becomes more expensive for you to drive a, a petrol vehicle in, in Nigeria. Yeah. The petrol price have gone up. All these buses, you can use natural gas. Oh, hey, this is Innocent G20 Smart. Oh, hey, and it's converted. You can see. To CNG. It's CNG. And it still has the normal engine. Yes, normal yes, I have normal petrol. So you can switch. Transformation. Can switch yes. Then this can power this vehicle and yes. start moving the vehicle. Yes. Does it have sound, like normal engine sound or something? Of course. Is that normal uh, engine sound? Same as. Uh, for real? You didn't even know it was one before, right? I don't know. But because of the cleaner engine. Yeah. The cleaner energy. Uh, yeah. Because of the cleaner energy, you have more clean system. Sound. No, it doesn't make noise. Sound and it's noiseless. It's on now. As you can see now, it's on. Okay, yeah. Okay, this is the feeling for me. I mean, you don't need to pull that gas out. Just feel it from here. Great people. Okay. Well. And you can see it's on. The switch between the CNG and Wow. This is great. Powered by CNG. Compressed natural gas. But the truth is that you can even do this for any of your cars when you bring it to Innocent. So you can switch any car at all. Of course. You can, can bring your cars that are... This is the engineer who will do it for that you. That is powered by petrol by and power. switch it into CNG, CNG. Compressed natural gas. So start bringing so in your cars and start switching in. So you, you can bring your cars, mind. all those your Mazdis, your Corolla, your Camry, <laughs> and switch the car into CNG. Oh, but they will do it right here, right? Yes, we'll do it right here. This is Innocent's truck. What kind of truck is this? It's a normal truck, a true truck. So everything is like 100% manufactured here? Yes. This is manufactured in Nigeria, made in Nigeria. We have the molding machines and all the details. So like 100%, everything this is, 100 is made, made, in made in Nigeria. Yes. So what are they doing here? Let's see here. This is painting session. All right, wonderful people. All right, wonderful people. You know, I always bring reality to our people because we always face reality. And I hope every one of you understand this video that we just finished watching. And I want you at the same time, pay attention to the second video that is running. I'm going to explain to you all. It's very, very important that we understand who we are. We are the pillar of that contraption called Daminable Zoo. We are the pillar. But before I proceed, there's something I want to let our people understand so that you will not make a mistake. We are Ndibo. The land of Biafra is Alibo. I hope you're getting my point. We are all Igbos. It does not matter your dialect. We are all Igbos. Now you understand. The video that is running down to this, my video now that I just muted, was the first man to manufacture a car in that contraption called Daminibu Zoo. And entire Africa is an Igbo man. Are you getting my point? The first man to manufacture a car in entire Africa is an Igbo man. Are you getting the point? We are coming here to tell you things the way it is. If you people haven't forgotten, I'm here to remind you things. During 1967 to 1970, every, every armament that we used to fight the war because we were fighting the world. We are built and manufactured by Igbo people. Are you getting the point? I don't know, maybe you understand what I'm saying. That is why you see, they won't allow you and they won't give you a chance because they know who you are. You can turn things around. You can make things happen. And we are saying, challenge us. And you are going to testify the goodness of Shuko Kikabiyama in our life. Five years. We are going to transform Biafra land. 
but they do understand. That is why they don't want to allow you to go. This is our brother Innocent. As the price of fuel is getting higher, he is bringing a new dimension to reduce the poverty. Would they allow him? The answer is no. They won't allow him because he's an evil man. Now you understand what I'm talking about. We are the pillar. We are the strongholders of that contraption called Daminibusu. But someday, we are going to leave them behind and show the world who we are. For some of you don't understand. We were intellectuals in our mother's womb. We are thinkers in our mother's womb. We were born to be a manufacturers. We were born to be a thinkers. That is why we believe in ourselves. That is why we were asking for the freedom of Biafran people. We have been fighting for survival and we will keep on fighting for it till Biafra is totally restored and beyond. Now, do you understand what I'm talking about? I saw, a, I saw the presenter saying this is made in Nigeria. It's a lie. It's manufactured by Biafran people in Anambra State, in Newe, if I'm not mistaken. By Innocent, our own, a great man, a great son of his son or a great son of his father let my grammatic to be correct now you understand the whole armament we used during 1967 to 1970 that we were fighting the war we are manufactured by ourselves let me introduce myself before i will move forward all right wonderful people Freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, great people all over the world, you are welcome once again on IPOB Rapture Media. Under the leadership of Mazen Nandi Okuchukukano, here I am. I always set the record straight. My name is Mazo Okenina Okechukun, known as the Biafran Child in Washington. They are general. Now do you understand? They won't give you a chance and they will never allow you to go. Let me repeat once again because I don't think you heard me very well. They won't give you a chance and they won't allow you to go. And they will come around and begin to tell you that diversity is our strength. Make that diversity kill all of you people there. Make thunder of diversity massacre all of you people. Who are you people talking to? Which diversity is your strength? Make the diversity hammer all of you on that day. Make that diversity kill all of you. You people are coming to take our territory and impose to us, the great people, the movement of jihadism, Islamization and Fulanization. So, I can never allow it to be. We are fighting for survival. And we will keep on fighting for this survival till Biafra is totally restored and beyond because we are going to build the kingdom of Chukukikabiyama on this earth. I'm telling you people, if you like, you believe. Chukukikabiyama is our chief. And there is nothing anyone can do about it. We can never Accept that your nonsensical movement of jihadism because we know who we are. We are born to be manufacturers, born to be thinkers, born to be a philosophers, born to be a builders. That is who we are. And Chuku Okikabiyama blessed us with that. That is why we are proud of who we are.
That is why we are asking that we want to go. So we are going to shock the world. Now do you understand what I'm talking about? We are the people. And all must hate the Afro. And Chukwoki Kabiyama must take glory. So shall it be. He say. He say. He say.